Right guys, as promised, here's those finished paintings, the watercolours of the fox and hare. I've got a lot more, but these are the finished ones. Lovely, eh? I'm going to do more. They seem to be popular, so I'm going to be doing more for the Christmas sales. I know it's a bit away, like, but better to be prepared and ready. I just thought I'd show you these <laughs> since they're finished. You can just imagine these framed on your wall. Lovely. I've got more, I'll show you these. Uh, I've got these other couple to complete, but I'll show you these as well. Let's go. Now I'm also going to show you another piece of work in progress. This is my 18th century lady. And as you can see, there's still a lot to do to it. But I'm, I've been doing it with uh, my palais knife and some brushes. So yeah, she's coming along fine as you can see. <laughs> Lovely. Have this and we'll get on with my painting. These are the unfinished paintings that I'm going to complete. So they're ready to upload to my EB shop this afternoon. Just a couple of touches to do.
It's a nice day today and I might just get out and about.
Right, that's them. Done just to sign them. So I'll let them dry here before uploading them. Lovely. Another job done. <laughs> I see it at last, a break. Just get the microphone on. Wap a lava, eh? Ooh! Get a seat at long last. That's me finished for just now. Before I finish the vlog, I thought I would show you. Just adjust this. I thought I would show you some of the reading material that I've been reading lately. Now, as you know, I've started doing my Tudor paintings again, so the first book I'll show you is Mary Queen of Scots. It's a book of Mary Queen of Scots. <laughs> reading material, research. Next one is a book on Elizabeth, Elizabeth the first, and by the way, Channel 4, the UK's Channel 4 st the TV station is going to air a new series called Young Elizabeth. It's a, I think it's a series, so I'll be looking out for that, so it gives you a little tip to look out for. Young Elizabeth, Channel 4, UK, United Kingdom TV. It's a new series. Well, it's going to be well uh, watched by me anyway. I'll have a lot of research to do in that as well. Love these programs. Uh, Wolf Hall is a tip for you. If any of you people out there are doing historical paintings or doing any historical research, look up Wolf Hall. Yeah, and that's another good uh, film series. The hair, I've showed you this one before, and Rayburn, Rayburn's book on, I'll show you this, this is one of the, I mean the hair, it's obvious why, why I'm doing the reading on that, is because I love hairs and I paint the foxes and the hairs as you know, so as you've just seen, but anyway, Rayburn's book is the one I'm researching for that 18th century painting that I've done through there well uh, that I'm in the progress of doing but if I'll let you have a wee look through this Rayburn was a great artist from Edinburgh Scotland you can look him up as well look at that lovely eh? I thought I'd let you know what books I'm reading at the moment for my research or whatever and for a pastime lovely eh? excellent painter but uh, yeah he was one of Scotland the UK's finest portrait painters very famous artist Lovely, isn't it? So, these are my reading material for the next couple of days. I thought you'd let you see, so I'll say bye-bye for now. And I think I'm going to be heading up to Leafy's Wood to take in the atmosphere, get some exercise, do some sketching, and I want to try and pick some raspberries as well. So look out for that vlog coming soon. Anyway, let's get move on to the next vlog. Hope you enjoyed that one. That bacon and eggs was lovely. Bye bye. So bye then.